bracket connection type 1. Bracket connection type 1. Suppose this is the column, This dotted line is web of the column. Web of the column. A bracket plate. The bright plate is connected like this through the weld. This is the weld on three sides. This is the weld on three sides. And a load P is acting here like this. And uh, let us take this is depth of weld is D. Depth of weld is D and uh, width of weld is A. This width of weld is A. And this P is E distance from the P is E distance from the web center. Or it is let us take it is E naught. E naught distance from the web center like this. This is bracket plate. bracket plate separately we have this weld is like this This is the weld. Let us take this is the centroid of the weld. Centroid of the weld. P load as acting E naught from the centroid of the weld. We are keeping this web actually at a centroid. This is the centroid of the weld. And here, let us take this is x bar centroid from left side of the weld. 
And now here, the P, if you take here like this, and one more P here like this, now two things will be acting here. One is direct force P and the moment. This is actually moment. It is moment m equal to p into e naught. Now the weld will experience direct load p as well as twisting moment m that is p into e naught. Let us have this one, this weld C C2 outer edge. Let us take this distance as r. Distance as r. Now here direct shear stress. Direct shear stress due to direct shear force P equal to Q1 equal to load by effective area of weld. Load divided by effective area of weld. Effective area of weld which is equal to load is here p effective area means length of weld 2a plus d and throat thickness and throat thickness that is the direct shear stress then stress shear stress due to twisting moment shear stress due to twisting moment q2 equal to q2 equal to we know uh, from theory of simple bending i mean the theory of uh, uh, torsion formula theory of torsion we know t by polar moment of inertia ip or j t by ip equal to shear stress by radius here t is twisting moment is p into e naught by ip polar moment of inertia equal to q by r so q2 equal to now p r by ip p into e naught into r divided by ip is the shear stress due to twisting moment q2 now resultant shear stress equal to resultant shear stress q equal to or resultant qr equal to root of q1 square plus q2 square plus 2q1 q2 cos theta where theta is here this one here theta theta we can find here this is radius r this is radius r this angle is theta here here the resultant shear stress the resultant shear stress qr must be less than or equal to design strength of design shear strength of weld fwd which is fwd is nothing but fu divided by root 3 into gamma mw design design shear strength of weld is fu by root 3 gamma mw middle factor of safety of weld gamma mw this is the procedure to design this bracket connection type 1 